Uh, Jacob, tell us, uh, tell us how it happened for you since the Tour de France and it's, uh, this bad crash on the end. How, how do you feel? No, I had, uh, had to take um, a bit more than a week off the bike before I could get back to it. And of course, it's, it's not easy. It's not easy to to get started again, and, and of course also the motivation uh, is not the same. But now before coming here, I've had some some good days of, of training and a good period also. And we will see. I'm not I'm not on top condition. I'm not 100 percent, but I hope to be good enough to to support the team and and then try to find my legs doing doing the Vuelta and uh, and uh, and hopefully we'll we'll finish off strong and, and then there's some some big goals also lying ahead after the world cup but here the, the the goal is to support the team or there is other ideas like a stage or even maybe a gc uh, gc 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 normally no uh support the team yes and uh, and of course also trying to to win a stage would be would be something nice uh, but we have to see how i how i feel once we once we get started what do you think of the course I haven't, to be honest, I haven't looked too much on it. Uh, it's like always, Vuelta is always very, very difficult and, and, and a tough stage, a tough, uh, a tough parkour that they make. So it's for sure going to be be a difficult, uh, difficult Vuelta. But uh, on the other hand, I think that also gives a lot of opportunities for one like me for for, for trying to win a stage. That will be also a, a first big, uh, big test with uh, Miguel Angel Lopez working together in the team. Yeah, it will be the first time we race a Grand Tour with him, so uh, we see how that will, will go. But uh, I'm quite convinced that it will, it will be good. And, uh, and I think he has a, has a good chance to, to make, a, make a strong performance. What kind of goal do 